In Tianjin, China, there is a great scenic area called the Five Avenue, also known as buildings of variegated Western architectures, referring to more than 2,000 garden villas featuring architectural styles of different countries, built in the 20th and 30s of last centuries. Different pretty-looking houses. Neatly laid out street corners, even the plain trees and Chinese ash trees planted along roadsides can be full of surprises. <coughs> Look, it's an owl. How come this puppy here? The tree is in tears. These are the pictures an art teacher drew in tree holes. They make the bare trees in winter a beautiful street view. This young man named He Jin was born and raised in Tianjin. He often visited Five Avenue and accidentally discovered many tree holes on the roadside shade trees. So he came up with the idea of painting pictures to cover up the tree holes. Growing up here, so I often came to play when I was a child. I've always loved the Fair Avenue. I want to paint here. Using the naturally formed tree holes to expand art creation, tree hole paintings already have precedence in other countries and other provinces in China. Tree holes have been rejuvenated and start showing lively color again. He Jin observes the shape of the tree hole carefully and soon gets inspiration. He paints with a brush in the tree hole. Before long, the outline of two kittens appears. Many passersby stop to watch. People passing by took photos of my painting. Someone put it on the macro blog. One day, my friend told me about it. That's how I find out. Then someone recorded the whole process of my painting tree holes. Many admiring tourists came to look for He Jin's tree hole pictures. Some locals living nearby took their children here, enjoying the art. I drew things like little animals. That's what children love. Coming from an art family with childhood artistic edification, He Jin has a gift for drawing. He majored graphic design in college. Now is an art teacher at a children's palace in Tianjin. Drawing takes most of his time. Paintings can be found everywhere at his house. Actually, drawing is not the only thing He Jin is good at. This young Tianjin guy is very talented, and has widespread hobbies. All the furniture in his studio were built by his own hands. He loves animals. His pets include dog, doves, and small turtles. Although He Jin's work at the children's palace is not tiring. He keeps himself very busy every day. These materials scattered on the ground are things He Jin picked up at the hardware store. He learned from a friend that a dog has hind legs paralysis caused by disease. He's now trying to make a wheelchair for that dog. Normally, dog won't feel a thing on his paralyzed legs. He limped with real legs dragging on the ground. So we have to have the legs fixed on a movable device. Now on the market, a pet wheelchair costs 100 to 150 U.S. dollars. He Jin bought materials out his own pocket and has made wheelchairs for three puppies. This dog shelter locates in the suburb of Tianjin. This dog named Little Bro. His illness caused hind limbs paralysis, so he can only walk by dragged lower body on the floor. With the wheelchair He Jin donated, Little Bro finally can run again. I did the amputation for the puppy. 
We just need to make two little paddles in the ground, so his belly won't touch the ground. Yes, this is fine. This cloud can put him through the little and the little. Perfect. Thank you. He Qin's love for animals can be reflected in his paintings. Animals are always main subjects of his pictures. The six-year-old teddy named Mai Yi, besides being the best playmate, Mai Yi often acts as He Qin's model. He treats the dog like his own child. He also drew Mai Yi's picture in the tree house. Attracting passers-by, stop to watch. Now many residents of the Five Avenue knew He Qin's tree hole paintings. He must be a very caring person, loves dog and cat, and he draws well too. His colorful contribution made our city more beautiful. Art and culture have certain influence on people's mind and life. I think his paintings can warm hearts. So far, He Qin has created five tree hole paintings. The reason these paintings are all around a primary school is that He Qin hopes the children to see them and to take an interest in painting. To inspire talent as well, he used acrylic pigments so it won't cause any damage to the trays. In order to keep the colors for a little longer, the pictures were finalized with spray fixative twice. If take no account of vandalism, the paintings can last at least three months. Tree hole painting represents more than a creation of a painter. It inspires people of all walks of life on their own individual development. TJTV World.